what should I do immediately after sustaining an injury? Oh, great. Um, uh, so, of course, anyone sustaining an injury, uh, it, it, it is a, it's a moment of getting worked up. It is, it's a moment where athletes start feeling anxious. So, but we, the first recommendation, again, practically, is to, is to calm down. And how do you calm down when, when you tell someone just to calm down? I don't believe it works for anyone. It rather rattles the person more. And we practically approach the issue with some breathing exercise where the therapist participates with the athlete in certain breathing exercises just to get the nervous system to calm down. Because whatever the nature of the injury or the seriousness of the injury or, or, or the degree of the injury, uh, the most important aspect where you start addressing that you have injured yourself is, is by calming down. So I believe that normally happens in the first 24 to 48 hours where uh, support from the entire uh, coaching staff, which again includes the coaching staff, the fitness stage, the physiotherapist, it would essentially be to make sure that the, 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 the athlete calms down. And the second most important step that comes is is where the physiotherapist starts educating the, the athlete in, in a very realistic sense uh, as to how probably this injury would progress and what's the probable outcome of the injuries. So um, again, two little small points is, is to calm down, which you can do with certain breathing exercises. And the second uh, very important part, which the therapist has to participate in, is to educate the athlete to guide the athlete through the entire injury process.